Hello, Chef here. I'm making a real quick two egg omelet with some mushrooms, onions, and garlic. I wanted to share it with you. Here we go. Smash the garlic, give it a quick peel, and a really quick chop, kind of like this. I'm all done. Onion. Small piece is all you need for an omelet. Right like this. There we go. A real quick chop. And I'm all done. Uh-huh. Mushroom. Slice. Keep the fingers rolled back. Just slice like this. Uh-huh. And with a little practice, you can go fast. Okay? This mushroom's very ripe. Uh-huh. Here we go. I've got a hot steel pan. I'm putting two ounces or less of clarified butter. Starting with my onions and garlic together. And you let it cook. Next, we're adding our mushrooms. And you let it cook. Oh yeah. I'm using one of my favorite high heat spatulas. Watch the next video and learn more about this. At this point, I'm putting my ingredients into my prep scoop, just like this. Next, we're going to beat our eggs. Whisk mixing bowl. Eggs go in. and we beat them up. Notice I'm doing a figure eight. There's a reason for this, aeration. After you've beaten your eggs, add two ounces of milk or use less heavy cream if you've got it. Notice I'm using a steel pan. Non-stick wears off, steel does not. Iron is good for you. All these facts you're getting for free. Wow. Okay, move that butter around a little bit. The egg goes in all at once. And you let it cook using my high heat spatula, I go around the perimeter and tilt the pan slightly. The goal here is to cook all the eggs and please cook them well done. To turn the omelet, you loosen it up and you flip it. Ingredients go back on top, along with your favorite cheese, if you choose to have some cheese, and we flip it over. The omelet, garnish. I have some flouring Thai basil. We're going to put that on there. Also a couple of slices of this beautiful plum tomato. We're going to put that on there. Also I've got 
a little bit of uh, fresh avocado. We're going to put that on there. The finished omelet. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Check out the next videos. Oh yeah, it's going to be good. Drop a comment. Curious to see what people think of this type of omelet. Omelette paysan. These are thick, sticky, fat, juicy, number one grade Madagascar beans. They also have a variety of beans from all over the world. You can also contact the sponsor if you need gallons of extract, vanilla paste, or other gourmet vanilla products. So this is what I'm talking about right here. Sticky, the sticky. Let's get into the sticky. Oh, yeah. I'm going to put a little on this knife. By the way, this is a... Uh, uh, Japanese Damascus knife. You can learn more about this on the uh, channel. Just search Japanese Damascus knives and you're going to learn about these things. Really, really nice. Mm -hmm. Now, look at, the, look at what I got here. This is full flavor. This is where all the flavor comes from out of the vanilla bean right there. Uh-huh. Just leave a little bit off the neck here for fermentation and also because every now and then you're going to give a little shake you're going to tip it back and forth you want those air bubbles to move around the seed specks which you can already see So you're buying a Japanese knife online? Do your research. Professional chefs use our knives around the world. Check it out. Finish with a little bit of Fresh grated Parmigiano Reggiano. Wow. Hopefully, with proper care and maintenance, they will last you for decades. Wow. The perfect cooking surface. So as a professional chef, I get asked all the time, what is a safe cutting board? This is the one you've seen on TV. Professional chefs use them, and there's a good reason why. It's going to be good.
Wow, the Jambus Cucina Elegante, handcrafted with the finest American hardwoods, food service grade stainless steel. The Elegante features inch and a half thick butcher block, available in several sizes and with several options. Call your sponsor and save money. Ask for a discount. In my kitchens, I have several. This one here is going on, oh, I think, I think this end grain rock maple is over 20 years old now. It's been cut on a million times. The knife does not hurt it. It's the hardest surface you want for your knife. Contact like this. Cutting, chopping, slicing, dicing will not hurt the knife blade, will not hurt the block. Check your sponsor there. They're having a free shipping sale. Exceptional. <laughs> Select Hard Rock Maple is the chef's choice. Choose from several sizes, with a juice groove, without a juice groove, reversible, charcuterie board, solid walnut, solid cherry, even walnut rustic grain, reversible, round, square, rectangle, free shipping. Oh, it's going to be good. Wow, the Jambus Cucina Elegante, handcrafted with the finest American hardwoods, food service grade stainless steel. The Elegante features inch and a half thick butcher block, available in several sizes and with several options. Call your sponsor and save money. Ask for a discount. Oh yeah, it's gonna be good. Boost blocks, buy the best the first time, save money. You're gonna like it.
yeah. It's going to be good. Oh, so nice to cut on. Contact the sponsor. They're having a sale, and I know there's free shipping as well. Professional cutting boards, chopping blocks, butcher blocks, custom sizes, 